Hello boys and girls, my name is Hardsasty and welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included where we do have a bit too much water in here. And we have something here in the printing pot, so let's... Yes! Copper refined metal! That's what we need, because so far there is not too much ore to be found on this map. And then we also have not found um, any metal volcano uh, that we could use uh, to refine metal. What we do have bit of uh, suffocation yeah back there that's that's not a good place to breathe um, generally out here not that good a place um, but what I wanted to say we have power set up, we have quite a bit of gas in storage and we are not consuming too much power. Then up here we have uh, a salt cool uh, slush geyser um, which produces uh, cool salt water, we can desalinate use that for our farming. Um, that would allow us to expand the farm uh, part to add more duplicants. Um, but that still does not solve the issue with the uh, with the metals. There is a bit of gold amalgam, uh, there we have a large volcano, can use that uh, to uh, produce power, uh, but it's definitely a bit tricky to do so, so I have not yet really looked into how to do that best. Um, man, here we are mostly walled off, so I am wondering maybe we can go down here. And then Maybe something like this, that in that direction, just to see what's over there. Um, yes, um, we need some atmosphere. For our um, for our dock here, and up here, um, I have prepared space so we can lay out the power wire from down here, because uh, before we can desalinate. Uh, the salt water we have to heat it up slightly so that when it turns to water it does not freeze in the pipe and destroys the pipe so we have to ensure that it is at a usable temperature for our needs And 
over here we also have done a bit of uh, digging here on this side we are closing in on the uh, edge of the map um, do have a bit of iron and coal down here we can dig up Our food supply is more or less stable. It fluctuates a bit depending on the on the current harvest, but uh, with ten duplicates, I think we are fine. Do not really want to add uh, more um, because at the moment I think. Uh, we are coping with the ones we have. Uh, we can do a bit of uh, research. Is there anything that we really need? Uh, yeah, we can. We can go there. And probably also uh, automation a bit more. Let's also have a look at the uh, skills. There is no need to uh, to max out. Um, but with you, we want to go in this direction, so you need to have this. Yeah, we can have demolition. Camille, your morale is not that high. So, and Uh, maybe building would be beneficial operating yes okay that is sorted as well oh no power up here then we will also not uh, produce anything all right then we can see let's dig out over here This batch part of um, gold amalgam. Because we need something uh, that we can use for our construction. Over here it's cool enough so that uh, chlorine liquefies. There is a snazzy suit so someone can put that on. Um, We do have a bit of uh, of iron ore, so that gives us 200 kilos, 400. Should be good enough for two more suits. 
Um, then what's next on the list? Um, we probably should also think about cooling. Having a cooling loop for our base and then um, also we will need cooling for the refining of, of metals. Okay, the first suit is uh, being made, which means we can deliver it here. We still have a bit of copper here in uh, what's laid out, laid out as our uh, base. But I do not want to dig that up if we do not need the space. So that will have to wait. Um, I'm wondering, shall we make the cooling tank? here on this side and then have a small uh, cooling set up over here that would probably work so means we probably should have this And I will assume in the in the first season we had a one really large tank with a lot of uh, water, but actually we do not need that much. Um, basically, the amount of water we have in there is balances out the the temperatures and we have initially we have to have enough so we can pump in uh, water through the pipes um, so then here on this side we will have to do this then we have to pump this water over there so we can can clear the space um, that at least is something we can do um, And we will bring... Ah! Can bring that wire up to here. Okay, uh, that part is dug out here, so let's have a leather, actually we can go all the way up here. And then we'll 
have ladder on this side. There. Then we will probably go in here. Ladder. Um, liquid pump. And having a small transformer here means we would connect that. Like this, bit of piping, like so. Okay, and of course we want to dig out this pocket and then down here we'll have this tepidizer we'll control it with um, through the temperature of the water so that we do not heat the, the salt water up uh, to uh, incredible temperatures, but only to what we need. Just needs to be a bit above uh, zero degree. And it's probably not uh, a really, uh, really urgent uh, errand as we still have water down here and that's the water we are taking for our farm. But we have to keep an eye on it. That's, that's true. So then how are we doing here? Ooh, there is another volcano. I definitely have to look into what we can do with that. Okay. Mm. And over here. Let's have a ladder going down there so we can enter this room here. Looks like we have some water stored down there also dig all the way down there not sure if they can reach there because of uh, air but we will see how far they get and chip away here some more Pump side is done. Um, up here we are missing a piece, which is probably not reachable.
And then we should probably dig out this on the side so we have a bit more room for the water that we want to pump in. Then, once this is uh, emptied, we have a bit of space. Maybe I have to dig a bit more towards this side uh, so that we have enough space for what we need. But we should not need too much. Okay, they really cannot go down that far. Okay. It's not really something that's that's urgent. Here we are making good progress. Some more salt water on here. We are done with the research. So let's do this then. We do not need all the research as uh, in this season we will not go into space. Um, I'm still undecided on what the goal should be. Uh, one option is that we tame such a volcano um, and make use not only of the heat to create power but also um, the, uh, uh, the solidified magma can then be used because that I think turns to ingenious rock or sedimentary rock that we can feed to the hatches so that's also a good thing and we will take the copper ore here for sure as uh, that's something we do not have in abundance dig out here a bit more and we made our way up there. So there is another room there. We can. Go here and then Basically, dig through here and also take away all this gold amalgam on that side. Okay. We are pumping the water over here. Mm -hmm. 
which is good progress. Um, here we will need something like this, or let's let's make it the other way around. like this then this level on a lower level we will have these and I think we only need don't don't need to go overboard because they are quite power hungry uh, so I think you know, we will only have one, which means we only need one, um, uh, one uh, uh, steam turbine, um, which should make this a pretty compact build. But for the steam turbine, we also need. Um, Also need the uh, the plastic, and I think here we probably will need to uh, go with uh, plastic from oil, as I don't think doing it the way I did in the first season through uh, uh, glossy draglets. Uh, that's that's a feasible way to go. Uh, we can uh, have desalination from this geyser uh, for that water, because for the uh, pumps down here, uh, it really does not matter uh, what we have temperature-wise. question is more like um, how do we get to it but let's not uh, worry about that part yet um, because we also need steel And have not yet thought about that as well. So those are definitely topics for a future episode as we are way over time. So hope you enjoyed this longer episode and uh, tune in next time for more oxygen not included. See you then. Goodbye.